we are showing industry first live over the air demonstration of CBRS and license LT 2.5 gigahertz on the same network serving multiple providers it is also the first such demonstration on a single box that can serve both license spectrum and CBRS. We're here at the CBRS Alliance doing a demo of CBRS live over the air. So what we have here is a video. Uh, it's a live video going on. I'm back here in the in the screen, and you can see on the uh, on the video here. And um, what we do is uh, mostly we're we're focused on the enterprise use case uh, for uh, private LTE as well as for neutral host. Today we're doing a demo for showing the complete package for CBRS network, uh, showing the successful connection from and to uh, the EPC to the access point, uh, band 48 actually, and the MiFi device over the air, uh, along with the connection uh, between the SaaS server. at the CBRS Alliance today demoing a variety of things. We're de demoing our products, uh, small cell products, as well as our, our SaaS, our SaaS and CBSD. Our part of it is uh, the CBSD component part of that and uh, demonstrating the domain proxy. So. Hello, we are showing here carrier and mission, mission critical grade software solutions to enable the CBRS ecosystem. We also can support category A and category B devices, CBSD devices, and we also support virtualization and running slicing uh, innovative solutions. Whether you're a utility, a U American utility, which is a spectrum orphan, whether you're um, an energy producer who currently has to use proprietary products, whether you're a healthcare facility which has the burdens of HIPAA requirements but is still forced to use Wi-Fi and then bolt on top of all kinds of security mechanisms, LTE under CBRS is the first time these entities will have the opportunity to create truly secure private LTE networks that are protected, spectrum protected. Comscope is showcasing features and functions of its spectrum access system and its ESC sensor hardware. Using CBSDs from two major OEMs, we are demonstrating scenarios such as successful spectrum grant for a qualifying CBSD or grant adjustment for, a, for in case of an ESC event. So we are showing an end-to-end -end industrial IoT application uh, integrating from a sensor uh, through a gateway, through a CBRS network, all the way to um, the Predix cloud. So again, CBRS is about neutral host. It's about being able to connect uh, with very high broadband service, smartphones or fixed devices to eNodeBs, to be able to cover enterprises, to be able to cover industrial IoT applications. There's been an incredible momentum behind the CBRS Alliance with the whole ecosystem coming together faster than we've ever seen in a wireless market, I have to say. And it's a lot of it is due to the CBRS Alliance, their leadership, they're bringing all the ecosystem players together from OEMs to operators of all kinds. Um, and even starting to bring in some of the, the smaller companies, some device manufacturers. It's the alliance that's making that all possible. Whatever can be done at Wi-Fi can be done in CBRS, but even better. 